Good morning, boys and girls. Today we're going to read about the disciples. Jesus told everyone he met, repent, stop the bad things you are doing and start doing good. One day, Jesus was at a seashore and crowd gathered to listen to hear what he had to say. Jesus hopped onto a fishing boat so more people could see and hear him. Thanks for letting me use your boat, Jesus said. Then he said to the fishing brothers, Simon and Andrew, I want to thank you with lots of fish. Throw out your net. Well, try, they sighed. Simon and Andrew put their nets into the water. But we fished all night and caught absolutely nothing, they explained to Jesus. Suddenly, they felt their net tug. They were overflowing with fish. Rip, pop, snap. The nets were so full that they were breaking. The brothers pulled in so many fish that their boat started to sink. Help, they called their friends in another boat. We have too many fish. James and John rushed to their rescue. The weight of the fish almost took their boat under, too. They knew that their friends, Jesus, must be someone special. He was the one who told them to catch those fish. Hey, Simon and Andrew. Hey, James and John. Follow me. Jesus called to them. Let's catch people instead of fish. Splash! The two sets of brothers dropped their nets into the sea. They were not fishermen anymore. Now they were disciples. Now they would follow Jesus. Jesus met a tax collector at his office. Hey, Matthew, follow me, Jesus called. Let's collect people instead of money. Clink! Matthew, the tax collector, dropped his coins to the ground. He was not a ta tax collector anymore. Now he was a disciple. Now he would follow Jesus. Jesus met seven others that day. Philip, Bartholomew, Thomas, another James, Thaddeus, another Simon, and Judas. Fo follow me, Jesus said to each of them. Crash, bing, boing, boom. They all stopped and dropped what they were doing. Now they were disciples. Now they would follow Jesus. Jesus and his 12 friends, the disciples, shared the workload with many other followers, including Mary, Magdalene, Joanne, and Suzanne. No, no matter where he went, Jesus called for men and women, boys and girls, to drop what they were doing and follow him. Have a great day, everyone.